Nityanandam. My name is Ma Nitya Oviananda. I'm a Brahmacharini for Nityananda Order, and I'm living here at the ashram in Bidi. I would like to illustrate some events that have been happening here. Um, last night we were called to what is called our temple gate because there, were a cr there was a crowd there of some people trying to get into the ashram. So we went there to see what was happening, and there was a crowd of people, and they were yelling, screaming, throwing rocks. Um, and then I remember hearing some banging, and I saw some people picking up big rocks and throwing them over at us. Um, we were trying to actually defend the gate because they were pushing on it and trying to get into the ashram um, and saying a bunch of different things. Um, that was after our Guru Swamiji came through the gate. Um, they were trying to then get in after him. So then what happened was there was a bunch of sounds and banging and crashing and I was wondering what it was. And I looked and suddenly the crowd cleared a little bit and I saw one of our ashramites in that car and there was a huge hole in the windshield and these guys were banging on the car and I could see just the fear on his face and I'm like, oh my God, because I was wondering why are we there waiting because we were trying to help him get in the ashram safely. And I just saw them repeatedly with large stones hitting his car and, um, like I said, a hole in the windshield and everything else. So, I mean, it's just a very volatile situation. Um, I don't know who these people are that keep harassing our Swamiji. Um, I've been watching all day yesterday and today these media reports, um, these footages of people you know, trying to hit his car. I've had other people tell me what was happening when they were on the road with him. They were trying to basically hit him off of the road. And I don't understand why, because all he wants to do is spread his message of peace and the Vedic tradition to everybody. He does nothing but heal people and, and teach everybody of the Vedic tradition. And um, it's just, it's really heartbreaking for us here to not know um, if our safety is okay, why are they doing this to us, you know, why are they harming the Hindu tradition in this country because it is the foundation of this country. So these are all questions we have and we're struggling with here but we're just imploring people to look at the situation closely and understand what is happening from both sides and to then make your judgment and to help us stop the violence against our Hindu saints. Thank you.